All right, this is grade three, module one, lesson four, uh, where we begin to talk about division. And, and for this lesson, we're talking about the unknown is the size of each group. So when we see a problem, for example, um, eight divided by four, we know that eight for this lesson, 8 is going to stand for the total, and that 4 is going to stand for the number of groups, which means the answer, in this case 2, is going to be the size of each group. And that's what they're talking about here, the unknown as the size of each group. So I'm going to kind of belabor the point a little bit. We've, we've come from a series of lessons where we might see four groups and three dots in each group. So that's 4 times 3 equals 12. So it's the 4 stands for the number of groups, the 3 stands for the size, and 12 stands for the total. Now that we're talking to division, in this lesson, uh, we're, on, we're always going to be given the groups. So the 12 divided by 4 means 12 is the total. 4 is the number of groups in this lesson. And that means by a process of elimination, 3 is the answer, which is the size of each group. Of each group. All right. Now in a future lesson, Students are going to learn that you can also do 12 divided by 3, which means 12 is the total. And the 3 is the size of each group. And the answer, in this case 4, is the number of groups. All right, But that's a future lesson down here, this part. Today, when we're dividing by a number, it's the number of groups. So for this problem, we have 25 erasers, because it says so. And we can see that there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 equal groups. And so there are, and we can count, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So there are five erasers in each group. It doesn't ask us, but we could write the division problem 25 divided by 5 equals 5. This 5 stands for the fact that there are five equal groups, and this 5 right here says is standing for the fact that each group has five erasers. In this problem, Mr. Doyle has 20 pencils, and he divides them equally between four tables. Draw the pencils on each table. So, well, let's do it. And I am not sure how many pencils should go in each table, so I'm going to draw one. Well, I've used four so far. Four, so far. So that's 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Ah, so there's my 20 pencils that I've used up. And I can see that there are 5 pencils on each table. So our problem is 20 divided by 4 equals 5. Because for this lesson, we're doing the total divided by, in this case, it's the number of groups. And that equals 5, which is the size of the groups. And that is our video.